so the list of important topics for J are from mathematics. There is calculus, which is the most important topic as a whole. Then there is conic sections. There is complex numbers, and there is probability. From physics, there is mechanics. In specific mechanics, there is also this rotational dynamics, which is very very important. Fluid mechanics also is very very important. Then there is electromagnetism and modern physics. From chemistry, there is electrochemistry, carbonyl compounds, and the p-block elements. So in the chemistry also. Earlier the weightages were well different, but now they've almost come out to be same. So out of the 14 questions in chemistry, in J advanced, almost 13 to 14 questions are from organic, inorganic, and physical each. So you can't leave one section of chemistry. So for doing theory, what I did was that I read my class notes, and then I I loved reading books. So I read a, read a lot of formats of books. So one thing is uh, most important as I told, NCERT has to be read again and again because they are the most basic books and they are important for both J mains and J advanced as well. Now for physics you can use HC Verma, it will help you build your concept. And you can refer to problems in general physics by Iroto. It's a slightly advanced book but it's a good book for ITJ. In math, there are books for uh, separate topics are separate. So for plane trigonometry, there is a book by S. L. Loney. For coordinate geometry, also there is a book by S. L. Loney. Mm -hmm. For algebra, you can use Holland Knight. Mm -hmm. uh, for calculus, there is Thomas Calculus. Chemistry, uh, there is a book called University Chemistry by Bruce Mahan. Mm -hmm. uh, you can use that for physical chemistry. Mm -hmm. For organic, there are books by Peter Sykes. It's a short book, but it's very nice. It's called something like an introduction to mechanisms in organic chemistry by Peter Sykes. Then there is a book called Organic Chemistry by I.L. Finar. It's slightly advanced. Then you can refer to Concise Inorganic Chemistry by J.D.D. for Inorganic.